One of nature's most beautiful animals, the African savanna elephant, or Loxodonta africana, for short, is the closest relative to the woolly mammoth, a creature that went extinct in the Ice Age of the 1400s. Elephants have giant tusks and big feet. They are very mighty creatures. They have huge long snouts, which they used to spray each other with, play tag, and eat food. African savanna elephants mainly eat grass and mealworms, and that's about it. They use their long snouts to sniff the ground looking for mealworms, with, using their keen sense of smell. And when they find mealworms, they suck them up through the snout and digest them. On a good day, your average elephant can eat up to 30,000 of the mealworms. Elephants also need to spend a lot of time in water to cool off from the African sun, which is very hot. If, a if African savanna elephants don't do this daily, for at least six hours a day, they will die of overheating. Now, despite their huge size, they can easily stay afloat in the water without sinking, so there's no possibility of them drowning. Now, elephants have the option to reproduce asexually, which means the mother doesn't have to have a fertilized egg to reproduce. This means no mating necessary to produce offspring. This protects them from going extinct and is one of the only reasons they haven't gone extinct yet. This means that many elephants are just clones of their mother with few mutations since they have no fathers. All these elephants are female, but luckily elephants, like certain species of frogs, can change sex. That way they have an even number of male and female elephants in a group. The birth of an elephant is pretty simple. The mother's water breaks and the elephant falls to the floor in excruciating pain. The elephant is about to give birth. And boom, just like that, the baby elephant transports itself out of the mother's room right next to her. Scientists still can't figure out why this happens, but it does, and this footage is scientific proof. Anyway, thanks for watching, and be sure to hit that subscribe button for more totally legit documentaries.